there everybody welcome to my youtube channel sarah here with you and um you're being welcomed by my lovely green mat which needs to be replaced but i'm always like too lazy on replacing it well it still works so it's just fine um before i start the video i want to say i'm sorry because uh last week was uh, my exams and graduation project week so it was really really hard to make a video in that horrible week and just so you know i'm studying japanese at the japanese foundation and it's not easy it's just so hard to like uh study for this really awesome language but it's not easy to learn anyways it's time for some awesome black male history yeah there is like uh some creepy clowns on the cover here is one and here is one what's in the background there is a picture of a house so apparently this was a 40 paper sketchbook it was 70 grams so it was much much like lighter than your printer paper but well yeah drawing sketchbook sounds a lot of fun so let's start so there's a tweety here apparently this was my sketchbook when i was about 11 to 12 years old i think so there was a lot of looney tune stuff and and just really weird um characters you can say that i drew so yeah twee with some water based markers not bad for a 11 year old i guess ah this joke mom he was so cheap that he went to spend the honeymoon by himself <laughs> i don't know i just saw it somewhere i just wanted to draw this weird joke out let's see oh this is actually nice under sea kind of scenery this is actually kind of really nice actually i like it a lot pencil colored but it was neat for 11 12 years old uh oh hello there oh my god <laughs> here is how they started to practice people i guess i don't know this character is from digimon his name was davis in the um American version and Arabic version he was called Salim and then he had a totally different Japanese name so that was like oh god oh my god look at the legs look at the hands just wow no. oh god what the hell is this seriously what the hell is this face this is so damn creepy so is this supposed to be uh someone who's getting or something? I don't know. My proportions were absolutely horrible. Like, there is no breasts. It's just, I don't know, a circle and a very weird dress. Where's the legs? I don't know. It's just. Ugh. What is this? Um, random circles? And, I don't know. Some creepy clown faces over here? Moving on. Oh, oh god. Oh my god. Oh my god, no. No, no, no. What? Why is the thumb, like, supposed to be here? Why did I do it like this? Why, why? Why did I do it like this? Oh my god. It has love on it. What the hell is she wearing here? She had love on it. What's... What, what is up with the body proportions? Like, ugh. oh god, no, 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 no. What is this? Random typography? Well, it's a little better than the previous nightmare. Huh? My mobiles, my old mobile names when I used to have the uh, old black and white Nokia. It was so cool. What is this? Oh, that's actually cute. Some bunnies and a teddy bear and a birdie and a kitten. That was actually kind of cute. Moving on. Uh, well, I'm not sure what this is, but the tree have some really weird eyes. Moving on. Ah, uh, the Yu-Gi-Oh fan art section. Man, was I a Yu-Gi-Oh fan girl? Okay, I feel so sorry for murdering the Dark Magician girl with this horrible fan art. I was trying to copy it from some sort of a magazine or something, but oh god. <laughs> oh my god, it's completely murdered. Oh boy. 
Oh, of course I can draw this like in five minutes, but not with this. Oh god, I need to redraw this so I don't feel sorry for her anymore. <laughs> well, oh, ah, well, this is actually not bad. This is a decent, sort of decent, decent drawing, sort of, yeah. Her proportions are screwed up, and the hands, well, yeah, the hand is completely screwed up. But, uh, it's decent. You can tell it's a Yugi. Yeah, it's a broken Yugi, but yeah, it's decent. Mm -hmm. It's decent, yeah. What is this? Buffy, the spirit of the pure soul. Mm. This was my OC back then when I was so into Yugi that I made OCs for it because I did like a fan fiction for it. I'm gonna show it in a separate video, but, um, <laughs> Buffy the spirit of the pure soul. Actually, I like how the line here looks, but what the hell is Buffy the spirit of the pure soul? What the hell, man? <laughs> Actually, I like the costume a lot. I think it's cute and adorable. It's kind of fun. There is a millennium item over here, but again, the hands. And probably the proportions here have started to improve a little bit than the horrible sort of nightmare that was at the start of the, this. Oh, hey, look at this. This is another one of those Yu-Gi-Oh! OCs I did. I named her Phoebe. It's actually decent. The coloring is nice and the design is nice. Although there's a lot of anatomy errors. But um, it's not bad. I actually like this a lot. It's cute. What is this? Oh, a full Yu-Gi-Oh! poster! Oh my god, Kyla looks so horribly bad! <laughs> he looks so grumpy! <laughs> Yuki looks decent, Joey's like me with his crab hands. Taya and Mai, well Mai looks kind of decent. Taya looks just idiotic, but Kaiba, oh my god! <laughs> this is so awesome! <laughs> hey, look, I the logo is kind of nice. I kind of copied it like nice, but seriously, kind of like, oh my god, I want to thug life this picture so much. <laughs> Moving on. Okay, this apparently was me trying the Mandela's treatment. I don't know. Do you know those coloring books for adults? I think I was trying to attempt this or this random thing, but it was never finished with bar based markers. What else is there? Oh boy, some of my really creepy OCs is to do a lot of Yu-Gi-Oh OCs and they all have the same exact shape of face and eyes or maybe this was one character that I was trying to do two clothing for. No, actually it's the same character but I was trying to do some random clothes for when there was, I don't know. Look at the pants, how wide it is. I don't know, but back then it was like the white baggy pants. It was really in style so much. Um, this kind of t-shirt as well. So I guess I was doing that based on, you know, just playing around with a random character that I made up inspired by the Yu-Gi-Oh style. Speaking of Yu-Gi-Oh, more Yu-Gi-Oh stuff, Millennium items. Why am I drawing the Millennium, I millennium items? Oh, this is creepy. Creepy eyeball. Creepy eyeball! Oh god. Now, this one is missing something. I don't know. The key of life? It's supposed to be in the ancient Egyptian mythology, the key of life. It's missing an eye. All of these, all of these, 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 they all have eyes except for this one. Maybe because it's the key of life, it doesn't have an eye. Because this eye is evil. This eye is evil. And the key of life is not evil. See? What else here? Oh, hi there! This is actually not bad. It was me trying to change up my OCs a bit, despite that I still had horrible anatomy issues. Like, oh god! <laughs> I'm not gonna talk about the hands. Like, I was trying to do muscles and stuff, so yeah. Not bad. Oh, hi! Another a pink magician girl. Okay, so Pink Magician Girl. I used to make a lot of Magician Girls OC sort of like, I don't know. I really like Dark Magician Girl a lot and uh, 
this was Pink Magician Girl. I guess she was one of the characters I put in my Yu-Gi-Oh fanfiction. Yeah. <laughs> what is this? Sarah, what? Tilson? What? I made myself an OC and I called myself Sarah Telson. Oh god. <laughs> Moving on. Oh, hi. This is good! It's my Sarah Tel Tyson. Oh, it's a Tyson, not a Telson. My OC with the Yugi next to her. With uh, the full Yu-Gi-Oh. Actually, I did a good job with this one. The, the, the logo thing. This is actually pencil colored. No, it's more like pencil. Actually, this is decent. The logo is really decent since it's handmade, but, um... Uh, yeah, my Sarah Tyson character. And Yugi! Man, oh boy, oh boy. Boy, oh boy, oh boy. What is this? Lara. Who the hell is Lara? Another weird OC. Okay, this is done. What is this? Uh, okay. Oh god, no! No, 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 no! <laughs> this is when the cheetah girls were so into, like, the boom type of thing, you know, like, we're the cheetah girls and the movies and stuff. Oh god, my lost young early teens age time. I tried to create a band and I called them what? Maria Pr Summer and Jenny. Mm. Aside from the names, well, the names are decent, but uh, <laughs> what the hell with these? <laughs> the style of coding is not bad, but oh god. And I actually like the idea that I wanted to give some hair details with the fine water marker stuff. <laughs> <laughs> but they all have the same faces, don't we there? <laughs> What's next? The angels, what were this angles? This is spelled wrong, this is angles. <laughs> I wanted to call them angels but they came up as angles. Um, MPSJ, oh that's the initials of every name of the band. What's next? Ah! The male version of this angel band. Oh god, oh god. Oh, thank god I have not continued this horrible nightmare. I mean, look at this face. What the hell is this with this face? This rape face of, like, I don't know. It's just the creepiest rape face ever. It's really cringy, man. Like, they all have the same faces, but oh my god, what the hell with the heads? Uh, I was trying to draw a male with crap arms, crap hands. Ugh. Moving on. Oh, the sketch is done. Oh, with the video as well closing up to I don't know, 15 minutes. Uh, I have a strike on my account, so since I have my first strike, I can't upload more than 15 minutes per video. So look forward to the second tour of my other sketchbook in another video so i will see you guys in my next sketchbook video okay see you later bye bye